Hello, I'm Miss Beeler. I just would like to share some information about the classrooms so that you become a little bit more familiar with the program, Young Fives. I am the teacher, and this is my classroom, room 214. I'm going to cover a little bit of things that your students will learn through the school year. We will be doing some socializing, of course, playing, learning how to cooperate with one another and problem solve, and practice some routines like lining up and going to the bathroom and using the sink the appropriate way to wash your hands, going to the lunchroom and cafeteria, and walking to specials. We have art, music, gym, and this year we have library, which is also very fun. Your child will also be involved in outdoor play, which is great for exercise. We play with Play-Doh, which is wonderful for our hands, strengthening our muscles to get us to prepare to write. Speaking of writing, we will learn to write some numbers and some letters and, of course, our name. We will be able to identify our names and our numbers and our letters as well as our colors. We have an awesome Promethean board in our classroom. Each of the classrooms has one of these where the kids can interact with technology. They also have their own iPad that they will take home every night and bring back the next day. So we want to make sure that it's charged. Over on this table here... I have some things that we should go over real quickly. The students will be able to use manipulatives for counting and patterning. Some of the things that we have in our classroom are little bears, and we have popsicle sticks that they lay in order, and they count, and they place them down to learn how to count and find the amount. And we also learn to compare some amounts, and they each get eight crayons. I know that's not a very large amount of crayons, but we want to know, we want to make sure we know how to identify the colors and be ready to use them in kindergarten. We also learn songs that will allow us to remember how to spell the colors. Each student has a folder. This is what it looks like. It should go home every night and come back. If it doesn't come home, it's because it's empty. Tonight it has a brochure inside for our book fair coming up. So that it will go home tonight and then just bring it back the next day. This is what our iPad looks like. They can be picked up actually Friday from 2 to 4 this week. And hopefully your child already has yours. It's important that they bring a pair of headphones that, so that they can hear what their iPad is, is projecting. And we also have right now we're working with Play-Doh a lot, learning how to cut it. With scissors, we're rolling it out, strengthening our muscles in our hands, and we're really learning how to get along right now, using our manners and keeping our hands to ourselves, practicing being able to listen to stories and sit for about five minutes so that we can understand what stories are about and we can listen to pe people read, especially me. It was nice to have you join me t tonight at Curriculum Night. I am going to be here all year with your little ones, and they will be in the best care because I absolutely love children, and I can't wait to see how the year goes and how well they'll be prepared for kindergarten.